Hey guys, how's it going? Happy TGIF. I really enjoy this audio. It is short to understand, but may take a lot of practice every moment of the day. I have been practicing it for about a month or so now, and I have encountered a bunch of really, really good experiences. I can't even explain it over here. I trust that you'll find it interesting as well. Um, using headphones or earphones will maximize your enjoyment. Wishing you an awesome Friday. Have a good one. Chill. I have one quick question. So the segment intending, I have just sat down to meditate and been in the receptive mode every morning or gotten there, but I haven't segment intended before it or in the middle of the day. Here's the advantage of segment intending. This all falls under the heading of getting out ahead of it because as we were just discussing, if you wait until you've got negative momentum going, which is what a belief and a perpetuation of a unwanted expectation is, if that's underway and you try to turn it, it almost never turns. It can if we have an hour together, but it almost never turns. It usually just causes you to practice the resistance more. So what we've been saying is if you get out ahead of it and there are two primary ways to get out ahead of things meditate that gets you out ahead of it and then when you're walking into a segment stop Esther has been carrying a notebook with her and she's writing 30 or 40 or 50 segments a day which doesn't take very long most segments don't take her more than a minute and sometimes when she goes back to read it she can't even read her writing because she's writing so fast but it caused her to focus as she was at the airport yesterday getting ready for a flight she took out her book and wrote something to the effect of I really look forward to this flight I'm going to really enjoy the beautiful humanity that surrounds me I'm eager to notice the positive aspects of those people. I love the feeling of appreciation of the efficiency of this era I really like seeing efficiency and excellence and so she got on the airplane and while she's sitting there, all of that's happening. There are nice people everywhere and she's just sort of not minding her own business, just sort of watching them. And it was lovely to see. And then suddenly a flight attendant came. Esther could feel her coming from the back of the airplane fast. Da 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 da. And so Esther didn't look back, she just waited. And as she went by, Esther could feel a focus within this flight attendant and she went right into the cockpit and got the captain and they both did it did it did it back down the aisle and Esther thought that's that efficiency and focus that I was talking about there they are that's that excellence and there was something going on in the back of the plane that was going to cause a delay but because they stopped the boarding it was a bit of a delay but not very much and Esther's sort of smiling because either she sensed it coming or she made the mess in the back she's not sure which it was <laughs> but in either case she got to witness really over the top efficiency of a flight attendant and a responsive captain and so while that was happening a girl sitting in front of her and a girl sitting across from her and another girl sitting over there now They've all got their heads together in a sort of powwow. And they're saying, what do you think's going on? <laughs> Nobody knows, can't see what's going on. And then a girl who was back there came down the aisle walking her baby. And they all said, what's going on? And then one of the girls said, this is the most fun I've had all <laughs> week long. Where have you guys been? And Esther said, I know. Where do you guys live? They all lived in the city Esther was departing from. Esther said, let's exchange numbers. We should play together more often. <laughs> really? Really? In other words, they were all just up for it. No one was worried about anything. There was no tension in the air, just this playfulness. And Esther could not help but notice that. The things that she had written, this is the first time that she has ever written the words, enjoy the beauty of the humanity that surrounds me. And there they all were. Enjoy the efficiency and excellence of this airline. And there it all was. Esther's not saying she created all of that, although she was a part of it. What she's saying is she had her ears on in the forest. There wasn't a vibration going on that she wasn't tuned to. She had her dial tuned for that. And what she was tuned for is what she was experiencing. Everybody in the airplane didn't experience the fun that Esther experienced. 
you see what we're getting at segment intending segment intending puts you in a place of realizing the power of your own directed thought the difference between segment intending and meditating meditating is a quieting of your mind to listen segment intending is you thinking about what you're thinking about so here's the thing only segment intend when you know you're already under the influence don't try to fix something with your segment intending decide that you're going to derive pleasure from the segment that you're walking into so if you were to look back at Esther's notebook she's got a stack of notebooks from the last three weeks she fills up a notebook almost every day skinny little thing but she still fills it up almost every sentence starts with I love or I feel or I appreciate in other words it's from an emotional basis of wanting to feel good that she is setting her awareness in motion and then you know what happens as it happens you're tuned in she might even be receiving she might even be receiving what she's writing who knows we do <laughs> she might even be receiving it but then as it plays out her satisfaction factor is enormous it begins to make you feel the word invincible could be the right word but it's not the word we want you to focus on it makes you feel so loved so listened to so noticed so important so worthy so much an important part of the unfolding of everything around you you say at last you are realizing your own power your own value your own being at last is a little bit what you were reaching for I'm finally where I want to be and not where I don't want to be and so at last is one of those tricky focuses that could go wonky but isn't in this case at last here I am in this now at last isn't at last when you think about it literally isn't at last right now at last is now and so instead of at last now 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 I'm tuned in tapped in turned on so satisfied with what is and so eager for what's coming not afraid of what's coming not worried about how it's going to come not worried about where and when and who and how just knowing it's coming and eager for the unfolding like a movie that I know I'm going to feel great as I watch it yeah great thank you yes.